Hey there, spooky pretties and all newcomers to my channel. You guys know what today is. We have been waiting months for this. Today, the Scream 5 trailer has dropped, or just Scream as it's been titled. And I decided to do my very first reaction video in honor of this trailer. I have not watched it. This is going to be 100% a genuine reaction to this trailer. It has been up for a couple hours and I have avoided it like the plague. So I am so pumped to do this. I'm nervous. Honestly, I had really thought long and hard about if I was going to watch this trailer or not because I know there are going to be some spoilers. I mean, let's face it. And you guys just message me all the time with spoilery type images and and theories and I know you guys mean well but to control what I see and the information I receive I decided the best way would be for me to watch the trailer because I don't think I can avoid it until January you guys are just pushing it in my inbox so I'm diving in with y'all and I thought what better way to genuinely watch it with you here now and I hope if you attended the Fathom events this past Sunday and Monday, that you had a fantastic time at the 25th anniversary Scream showing. Yes, I know we all were a little disappointed that there was no trailer drop there and that there was no first look as we were promised, but we did get the teaser poster, which so far has received positive comments overall, and I myself enjoy it, and I can't wait to see other posters that come out into the world come January. So I'm gonna dive into this right now. Join me on this experience because I'm nervous. <laughs> and if you haven't watched the trailer and don't wanna know about it, please stop watching now. I don't want to ruin the movie for you. All right, so we are gonna do this. Oh, we got Jenna Ortega here. Oh, Amber's not having a good time. This isn't funny, Amber. Would you like to play a game, Tara? Uh, it's all vibes. Oh, fun! Doors unlocked. Oh, oh, oh! Oh, that's a nifty mechanism. I want that for my house. Oh, shit! Hello? It's happening. Three attacks so far. You have a gun? I'm Sydney Prescott, of course I have a gun. I'm Sydney Prescott, of course I have a gun. Something about this one just feels different. Samantha? I'm, I know who you are. I've been through this. Ooh, Jack Wade! This is your life now, which means that whoever this is is gonna keep coming for you. Ooh. The attacks were all on people related to the original killers. Whatever his link is to our past, it's pulled us all back here. Oh, Judy Hicks. And I won't sleep until he's in the ground. Oh, oh fire? January 14th. Oh my God. I'm going to have to watch that a few times. That was a lot. Like a lot, a lot. Okay. So <laughs> I'm pretty sure my mouth was open that entire time. So oops, but I couldn't help myself. There was a lot of attacks in that trailer, which I was kind of worried about, but 
not too terrible, spoiler-wise. I mean, we do know that people who were related to the original killers are getting attacked. They just said that in the trailer. That's pretty spoilery, but that's also exciting. I like that. I'm interested to see who's related to who and how they're related, whether it's son or cousin or niece or nephew or whatever. However blood relation they have, I'm interested to see that. And... I'm interested to see if the Jenna Ortega scene, it looks like her name's Tara, um, it looks like that could be the opening scene, but I'm interested to see if it ends up being something else and they are just leading us astray. But I'm surprised they showed so much of that. So, interesting. Um, I feel like I need to watch it again, but I'm not going to here. I'm, I'm going to sign off and watch it again and maybe post more thoughts online. But I will say that I think Ghostface looks ext extremely menacing and creepy. Seems to have a more lingering effect. I don't know. He, he was very creepy. Um, and this seems very intense. And it seems people are really involved in figuring out what's going on. Like Dewey calling Sydney, saying it's happen happening again. The characters meeting in a group to talk about who's been attacked so far and to figure it out. It looks like people are very much buddying up and trying to solve this thing before it gets out of control. So, okay, that was a wild ride. I'm excited for this film. Please let me know what you think of the trailer below. Did you love it? Did you hate it? Did you like it? Did you think it was spoilery? There were a lot of attacks in this, a lot. Um, I was worried that like with Scream 4, where we saw um, Adam Brody's character get killed and we saw Jill fly herself into the glass table and we saw Alison Brie's character get attacked and killed. Like that was a lot in the Scream 4 trailer. And there was definitely not 100% confirmed deaths in this trailer, but definitely several attacks, several. So, We'll see if those people survive. We'll see if those people die. Let me know what you think. I want to know. Let's discuss it. Thank you for watching me react to the Scream trailer. And if you're interested in subscribing to my channel, I am here every Wednesday to go over my Scream collection, as you can see behind me. And every Wednesday, we talk about all things Scream and Ghostface, new and old, in my collection. And I am also here every other Monday for Monster Monday and the last Saturday of every month for Shark Saturday. I hope you guys follow along and I will be back here tomorrow. Ta-ta, Sid.